Happy Wednesday, everyone! I apologize for running a few minutes late. I was in the middle of reviewing some contracts as I move forward with this television station to be able to share my content in a bigger way. Welcome! I hope your Wednesday is going amazingly well. If we haven't met yet, my name is Young Pratt, and I am the chief dreamer, author, and podcaster right here at Our Young Creators. At Our Young Creators, we are committed to equipping kids with real-world skills like podcasting so that they can learn to serve others, create a brighter future for themselves, and fund their adventures in the process. Now, over the past couple of days, I have been sharing a little bit about facing the fear, doing it scared, and putting myself out there in a bigger way. For the past couple of days, I have been listening to Alexa flash briefings, or my news on Alexa. And for those of you who aren't sure what that is, when you have an Amazon Echo device, you can have Alexa search things up for you. And one of the things you can search are little audio shows, usually a minute or two minutes, and they're called flash briefings. Now, I've been listening to those every morning, really kickstarting my day with some positivity and getting me thinking about what it is I want to do on my own Alexa Flash Briefing, which is coming your way very soon. One of the skills that I subscribe to is Gary Vaynerchuk's Crushing It. And again, it's just a little mini show, a couple of minutes, just to really, for me, kickstart my day and help me think about ways to show up bigger and how to do things better for all of you. So today on Gary's show, he talked about getting stuck in the middle. Just to give you some frame of reference, he's talking about as you're living your life, are you relegating yourself to getting stuck in the middle where, you know, people kind of know who you are, what you're doing, but you're comfortable staying in this little sphere of influence. You're not in a place where people don't know you who you are, but you're kind of in the middle and you may be growing. And he was really advocating that if you have a passion for doing something, you have a message and you know what you want to provide to the world, you need to do it bigger and you need to do it better and you need to up your game to get outside of your comfort zone, do it scared, face the fear and really make sure that each of us is serving the world in the ways that we were meant to serve. Now, for me as a business owner of 17 years, I thought for a long time that if I did really good work and I produced really great programs and classes and our productions were top notch, there would be enough buzz and people talking about what I was doing to help me build my business. And to a certain extent, that is that did happen. However, these past couple of years, and in particular since January, I have found some amazing mentors who have been questioning how I am showing up for all of you here because they believe in the message that I'm wanting to share with the world, this notion of turning consumption time on devices into creation time with our kids, and to really use technology as a tool to bond with our kids and not bicker with them. And more importantly, helping them to use technology in a way that they are learning to serve others 
to contribute to the world and to share their gifts and their talents authentically as well. So these mentors have been pushing me to get uncomfortable. And I have to tell you that I am really uncomfortable. However, it's feeling more exciting because things are coming together in a beautiful way. And now that I'm thinking about all the ways that I want to show up for you bigger, more opportunities have been presenting themselves. My Alexa flash briefing is coming your way very soon. I would love to know what you would like to hear on a daily basis from me. If you could let me know what you're interested in learning about, specifically as we're raising our kids to become creators for the next generation, to be the ones who are innovating, be the ones who are the business builders, and really showing up in a big way. I would love to know what you want to hear from me and how I can help you start your day or maybe end your day with an inspiration to help by guide your kids to become those creators. So if you're watching live or on the replay, please comment below and let me know what you want to hear. I appreciate you tuning in with me live today or on the replay. I will be back again tomorrow at our new time of 101 Pacific time. I was trying to go in the morning, but I find with the flow of my day this time after lunch, after I've checked emails and done some tasks in the morning, that this time at one o'clock is right before I pick up my kids from school. So I can assure you that our time together is not going to be super long because I'm on a deadline and, but I still want to show up and give you lots of value and really start you thinking about you and what you're doing in 2018 to make a bigger impact, to get unstuck from the middle as a business owner and as a parent and to accelerate your passion, accelerate your family, accelerate your business so that we're not getting stuck in the middle. If you would love to join me on this adventure of facing the fear, doing it anyway, doing it scared, let me know that below as well because I love being able to find people across the internet who are like-minded and who are also moving in the same direction so that we can start to hold one another accountable and to inspire each other to reach that best version of ourselves. Okay, my friends, I'm going to run and go pick up my kids from school. I will catch you right back here, same time, 101 Pacific time tomorrow. Cheers.